Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I'm still doing these uh, three-point curve designs and playing with them. I can't really figure out how this gentleman is getting this shape from this. Maybe my mathematician, but I did do it. But what's so neat about it, you can have them at different angles. You could have them, you know, like this, like a roof tile. I've got this one off a little bit. And see, this one's going this way, that one's going that way, so you could just keep moving them around. So the way I came up with this is to do something like this. So we're going to take an ellipse, and we're going to hold down the control button and make it perfect. Then we're going to hit the plus sign. And while holding down the control button after it moves, we want to go to about right there. Now take this one, control D or hit the plus key, and go to the center, and we're going to rotate it 60 degrees, and then just control D all the way around. So you get that shape. Now we can take the smart fill tool and get away with, I cut too much. Try to just cut the inside. And there you have that shape. And this shape will fit inside of itself, kind of like a tessellation. Let's left click, right click. Let's hit the plus key, move this node to here, and then just keep hitting the plus key and or the duplicate key and just keep doing it. Once you've got, you know, several of them, three, let's move to a new part of the page. And then all you have to do is control D and take this one and move it here. And then you can just control D and you can just keep going on forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. And just take this one, tell you what, let's move this one out of the way. This is how easy it is. Now this is a little bit harder, but it's doable. So now just select all these, hit your plus key, and just take a node and put it where the other node goes. And then you just keep doing that. Now the next one, you'd want to go the opposite direction so you wouldn't be, and we could actually do that now. We could put this node, well, I'm lost because I, I was actually showing. So you could put this node here, so you're kind of going straight up and down. Now, in the next several days, I'm going to use something like this for a uh, 3D pattern. I'm going to run out to the shop and, and make something like this to see how cool it is. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.